Yo, what's up? It's your boy Pakelo Kompits here, back again with you all with another video. And in today's tutorial, I will be showing you guys how to create a baseline like Mr. Taylor. This baseline I call modern baseline because it sounds different from the basic baseline that the beginner producers use. Um, so I will show you guys how to create a modern baseline. Uh, it's more advanced. Uh, you will have to watch this video over and over again until you understand how to do this and perfect the baseline. Uh, I also have a giveaway for three random producers. The requirements is, is going to be to give this video 100 likes. So each and every one of you that watches this video right now, please give this video a like to stand a chance to win one of my projects. Um, also go ahead and comment your name in the comment section below so that I can select the three random producers that is going to win one of my projects. So without wasting any of the time, let's just get started with the, with the video. So the baseline is going to is going to sound something like this, and this is going to be one of the projects that I'm going to give away to one of the three pro, uh, producers if I get 100 likes on this video. So yeah, that is how the, the, the baseline and all of that is going to sound like and the full track is going to sound like this. So yeah guys, 100 likes, 3 random producers will get one project each. Uh, and comment your name in the comment section below. Okay, so now let's get started with the, with the baseline, with the video. I'm going to start from scratch as well. Um, this, unfortunately, I can't uh, give away this project because it, I mean it's on the, same, uh, so on the same project. But I will do 3 different separate projects of, offline and then I will just select 3 random producers. Okay, so let me just do this. That always sounds so funky without the lead. And then let me just do this rather copy that. Over. And then let's do this.
so yeah guys that is how the track is going to sound like and all the track is going to need now is just a bass line uh hopefully you hopefully you have uh, watched what i've done with the processing of creating the pro uh, the beat hopefully you've done what i hopefully you've seen what i've done uh, i've just uh, got a unique style in my head and then i just laid it out on the on the uh, on the playlist or yeah on the on the channel rack um now for the baseline i'm going to show you guys how to do this uh it can get a little bit rough and tough at first but the more you do it the better you will get at uh, creating the baseline so for the baseline what you have to do is um if you don't have this uh, so i will i will just uh, do it as default so the main key or the the root note that i use is that i'm using for this project is c c minor i don't know c minor c c i don't know what what it is called but i think it's c minor okay so this is my root, this is my root note now i want only c minus keys to be highlighted so what i'm going to do now i'm going to click on this bar over here go to yelpers uh, scroll over to scale highlighting and then go down to minor natural okay so now i have that selected and then i'm going to now i just want to select my key that i'm going to use or the note then i'm going to go back in the scale highlighting and the key is c minor that's the key that i'm going to use so now all of all of c minus keys is highlighted not the dark ones but the lightest lighter keys so all of the lighter keys this over here this this one here this over here that over there so those are the keys for c minor okay and now the reason why i did that is well because i don't want my baseline keys to be in a in a different um key when i when i get to start making the chords for the baseline so that's the reason for doing this so now i'm just going to start uh, with the baseline when i'm done and then i will exp explain everything to you guys as well okay <laughs> Can you hear how the baseline sounds like? Okay, so that is how the baseline is sounding like. And this over here is just this. It's just this. So if I delete this, go back to my root note, put down my first key, highlight that, uh, put it one octave higher, and do the do the the normal baseline like this. Okay, so that is the normal baseline. But what happens is this key, the 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 top key, the last key or the last yeah, the top note it goes down from from here to there it goes down that's all that you have to do and you can leave it like that as well you can uh, leave the top key over there and then it sounds like that so that's that's how the modern baseline actually looks like so but you don't have to put that key over there if you if you want to put that note there you can if you if you feel like it so all i'm going to do now is i'm, I'm just going to uh, lay out my my keys over here so what i'm going to do here for this is i'm going to leave it like the normal one and then all i'm going to do now is i'm just going to fiddle around with with the keys and here's the other thing as well so as you can see here here's the chord but there's two notes these two notes is on the black or the darker keys so all i'm going to do now is just highlight those two and lift it uh lift it upwards or one semitone up and then do the same thing so this one here is on the darker key put it down and then do the same thing all of them is good and then this one over here is on the on the darker key put it one up okay so now i'm just going to let you guys listen to how this sounds so hopefully it's only this that's going to play let me put it softer <laughs> So over here, I don't know. So yeah, that's these all all of these sounds good. So what I'm going to do now with this is I'm just going to highlight holding shift, holding control, and just holding control and shift and just highlight uh the top keys. Because this over here is the normal this here is the normal uh baseline now the normal baseline looks like. But all I'm going to do now is I'm just going to highlight the top keys and holding control shift holding control and uh, just press down on your key on your keyboard 
okay so so there you go there's your baseline so what you can also do is you can go here to this range bar over here uh, yeah that range bar go to flip and then it will flip it from the right side to the left side but that's uh, that's how it's going to look like and then you can do something like this as well put that over there and just go down with the notes just go down with the notes that's on the black one just go down with the notes so this here is a lot further than it needs to go but hopefully it will sound good as well so we don't need this one but all of these here is like the baseline baseline the modern type baseline sounds that comes out of the baseline so there you go there's the baseline and this is what you can use over and over again to create your baseline it just depends on which key you want to use first and which key you want to use last so there you go there's your progression for your for your uh, baseline so now all i'm going to do now is that i'm just going to take one of, out of out of the bunch and then i'm going to lay it down and then i'm going to start my baseline and then i'm going to go back i'm going to listen for that one this one over here the one that i want so it's this one here so that's what i want to do it's tum tum okay so it has to be something like i don't know if it's going to something like this maybe and then but the more experience you will get with this you don't have to do this uh what i'm doing now i'm just doing it to show you guys i can do it without doing this without like going back to this side and taking one uh, octave or one uh, chord over here and going back put it there i can do it without doing that but i'm just i'm just showing you guys how how you can also do it uh to to get it to get these keys easier if you know what i mean so so that's how that is going to look like and let's just listen to the whole song with us <laughs> this year i want this key i wanted to go back down so something like this so that has to go like dum, dum. it has to go like dum, 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 dum. something like that it has to go like and then it goes down from here then I wanted to go back up again so now I'm just going to use these notes al alone here I'm just going to use those notes or this progression that I have here and then this one over here again
Okay, so so there's the there's the baseline. I could have made it more uh, like advanced, like the baseline itself more advanced. But I just going to I'm just going to leave it like that, and then I'm just going to copy it over to the commerce um, sound over here. Commerce, and then yeah, let's listen now. It sounds now. <laughs>
yeah guys that's how the track is going to sound like that is the baseline part of the video uh everything is there for you guys just watch this video over and over again try to do it on your own as well and yeah i will see you on the next video hopefully you've learned something from this video if you did learn something from this video give this video a thumbs up for me subscribe to my youtube channel if you haven't subscribed yet and i'm dj pakilo i'm out